Hi folks, and welcome to a Stone's Throw campground about 10 miles east of Tallahassee, literally right off Route 10. Route 10's right there. Uh, you come off the exit, you go up about a block or so, you make a left into what appears to be a gas station parking lot, and it's actually the entryway down the street to the campground. Now, this is an interesting uh, review simply because, you'll see in a moment, I'm the only one at the campground. Now, there were a couple of people here overnight. They've gone for the day already. Um, so I'm a little bit later this morning, took my time. But I'll show you around. Uh, it's a very nicely kept camp. Uh, the uh, washrooms and the laundry facilities are in great shape, uh, fully stocked. Uh, but there is also no one here managing. That might not be a bad thing, because what it might mean is they actually live very nearby, which is entirely possible. This is a main thoroughfare, Route 19, uh, that leads in a couple directions north-south in the, you know, the kind of the, the main office is right there. You can see it. They've got check-in. If you don't have a reservation, they use camping or campspot.com or something for the reservations. Um, the entryway nice wide all the roads good stone right now there are two folks who must be here long term and um, there another one spot over on the other side but all of these are nice sized pull throughs the power was solid and stable the water uh, good water pressure all of the spaces are clean and neat this one's got a bit of a rise to it. This would be 16, 15, 14. So maybe you want to avoid those 14, 13, 14, 15. But all the rest of them are nice pull throughs. You can see Doc over there. Uh, we had a 60 foot. I mean, it was perfect. Uh, and this is my first run with Doc since I changed out the, there's Route 10, since I changed out the injectors. Um, that's a project. Uh, if somebody wants to talk about that, I can tell you that it's not fun. It makes a mess, but it does help enormously when all six cylinders are firing. Anyway, so some of these are under this, like this two here, you would want to avoid if you had slide outs. Uh, but generally speaking, every one of these is really solid. Uh, and again, the facility very nicely maintained. Look at the landscaping. They have terrific... They've done everything they could with the space they've got. Some nice palm trees, uh, the, the oaks. It's really in good shape. No big amenities, but in terrific condition. The hookups, well located, solid. Obligatory power view. And for those of you who wonder, the idea behind the Gold's Gym ankle weights uh, makes for an excellent uh, lockdown for your, for your dump. Um, one of the uh, nice things too, given the dimensions, you can see plenty of room between rigs and plenty of room to make the turn. Isn't that great? So, not big on amenities, but big on space and practicality. Doc and I give a stone's throw, definitely a thumbs up. Uh, we didn't see anyone, but the transaction happened on the internet. Payment was made, services were rendered. We got our way in, we got our way hooked up, everything worked as advertised, and we had a really nice visit. So I, if this is a stop off or a pass through, good place for it, and right out in front, gas stations, all that kind of stuff, right within, literally within a few hundred feet of the campground. All for now.